Jim Carrey. Carrey was born in the Toronto suburb of Newmarket, Ontario, Canada to Kathleen, Neoram, a homemaker, and Percy Carey. A musician and accountant, he was raised a Roman Catholic and has three older siblings, John, Patricia, and Rita. His mother was of French, Irish, and Scottish descent, and his father was of French-Canadian ancestry. The family's original surname was Carr. Jim Carrey loved comedy since his childhood, as he sent his resume to The Carol Burnett Show comedy program when he was 10 years old, and his high school teachers allowed him to perform a one-on-one -on -one comic link to his fellow students at the end of every school day. In 1979, Jim Carrey began presenting individual comic strips in Ontario clubs, then moved to Los Angeles in the early 1980s, and began working at the Comedy Store, where he was noticed by the well-known comic at the time, Rodney Dangerfield, and brought him to work to provide an opening gig for his touring show. Curry then turned his attention to television, where he auditioned for the famous comedy show, Saturday Night Live, but he did not get the role, but he got his first major role in the series, The Duck Factory, which did not last long. After that, Carey continued to play small roles in some series, such as, In Living Color, and Earth Girls Are Jim Carrey's first role in a movie was in the 1981 movie, Rubber Face, after which he played many small roles in films such as, Once Bitten, and Peggy Sue Got Married, until he scored his first major role in the movie, Ace Venture, Pet Detective. In 1994, he was a great success, and then he played successful roles in films such as The Mask and Dumb and Dumber. In 1998, Jim Carrey won the Golden Globe Award for his role in the movie The Truman Show, and then in 1999, Jim won Carrey won a Golden Globe again for his role in Man on the Moon. In 2000, he gained further notice for his portrayal of the Grinch and how the Grinch stole Christmas and for the comedy me. Myself and Irene both in 2000, as well as Bruce Almighty 2003 Lemony Snicket's A Series of Unfortunate Events 2004 Fun, with Dick and Jane 2005 Yes Man Horton Hears of Him, both 2008, and A Christmas Carol 2009. In the 2010s, Carrie appeared in the films Mr. Popper's Penguins 2011 The Incredible Burt Wonderstone Kick-Ass 2 both 2013 Dumb and Dumber 2 2014, and portrayed Lee Day William in the sitcom 30 Rock 2012. In 2020, he portrayed Dr. Robotnik in Sonic the Hedgehog and its 2022 sequel and Joe Biden in six episodes of Saturday Night Live in the lead-up to the 2020 United States presidential election. Though largely typecast as a comedic actor, Carey has had success in dramatic roles. His first dramatic success was for starring in the Emmy-nominated made-for-television film Doing Time on Maple Drive 1992. Carey gained attention for his leading roles in The Truman Show 1998 and Man on the Moon 1999, earning Golden Globe awards for each film. He later starred in the psychological science fiction romantic drama film Eternal Sunshine of the Spotless Mind 2004. This performance is repeatedly allotted as the seminal in Carey's career, and for which he was nominated for both the BAFTA Award for Best Actor in a Leading Role and another Golden Globe Award. He was also praised for his dramatic role of Jeff Picciarillo in the Showtime tragicomedy series Kidding 2018, 2020, for which he was nominated for another Golden Globe. 2006, Carey received a Grammy Award nomination for Best Spoken Word Album for Children. In 2013, Carey published his first book, a children's story titled How Roland Rolls, which was awarded a 2013 Jellet Burgess Children's Book Award. Seven in 2020, Carey published his first novel Memoirs and Misinformation, which he co-authored with Dana Vachin. In the 2007 Hamilton Spectator interview, Carey said, If my career in show business hadn't panned out, I would probably be working today in Hamilton, Ontario, at the DeFasco Steel Mill. As a young man, he could see the steel mills across the Burlington Bay, and often thought that that was where the great jobs were. Jim Carrey, the great actor who changed the origins of comedy and art.